I got too many hoes, I can't fuck them all. I don't know how to play with a ball. Stacking that money up. Welcome to the video. I already done my brows off camera. I'm using my Real Techniques brush. And I'm using the Julia's Place Zulu palette in the purple shade into my crease. I'm just packing that color in my crease. Next, I'm taking my e.l.f. brush, blending brush, and I'm going into the Playing With Makeup by Yolanda Gemrock Universal Palette. I'm taking the color Slay and just blending that on top of that um, purple shape. Next, I'm going into the Zulu Palette, that pink shade. I'm using the Morphe M562 brush. I'm going right above the purple and blending that out as well. I'm going back into that purple and just packing it into my crease. And blending. Next, I'm going into the crayon case in that black shade. And I'm using the Morphe 5, I'm sorry, M518 brush into that black shade, just pretty much putting that in my crease. Next, I'm going into the Magic Palette by Juvia's Place, and I'm going into the color Faso and packing that on my lid. I wouldn't say this is a halo look, but it's just, I don't know what the hell I was doing, honestly. <laughs> now I'm using my liner, lining those eyes with my NYX matte liner. What the hell? Priming my face. Now I'm using the NYX Can't Stop, Won't Stop foundation shade Sienna. Y'all, this is like one of my favorites, for real, for real. Like, this and a couple other things, but this is the truth to me, in my opinion. I stay mad all day. All day, son. do the most now I'm going to Tarte Shape Tape I think he's a shade Tan Sand and Deep Tan Sand I believe just mixing those two under my eyes and brighten those holes up and I'm going to blend those out I haven't really decided if I want to keep doing voiceovers or do mix and match. This is my first video, so I'm trying to get a hang of this shit, but bear with me, y'all. Now I'm going into my Black Radiance powder in the shade Banana, I believe. 
use my stippling brush and just doing what I do. Now I'm using my Makeup Revolution foundation stick in the shade 517 or 517 F17 excuse me contour that face honey I'm using my black radiance palette to set the contour and to bronze now I'm using my black radiance finishing powder to set my foundation Next, we're going to line those eyes, that bottom lid, with my NYX, or my Wet n Wild, excuse me, Wet n Wild black pencil. And then we're going to smoke it out with the purple shades I used before on my lid. And smoke that thing out. It's pretty much just doing the same thing I did on top, on the bottom. Going in with some silver glitter liner, inner corner. Then I'm using the white shade from the crayon case, box of crayons on my brow bone. Now I'm just using some of that white from the um, box of crayons in my inner corner on top of that liner just to brighten that thing up a little bit now i'm using some blush um i think honestly this is a eyeshadow shade from one of those palettes but it all works the same <laughs> oh, now i'm going to go ahead and line my lips with the wet n wild brown pencil And I'm actually gonna use um, shape tape on my lips as a new lip. And it, y'all, this lasts forever. So I think I'm gonna keep using it. And I just went on top of it with a um, gloss from Wet n Wild. But I like the new lip though. Now my favorite part, I'm gonna use the Crayon Case Glow Cane and also the Maybelline. highlighter as well and peach molten peach spray my face with morphe then also i'm going to use some brow gel from morphe as well translucent those brows stay on forever and that's pretty much it just throwing that green wig i custom made that green wig so it was giving me beetlejuice vibes y'all Yes, Beetlejuice. <laughs> but um, I had fun with this look, first video. And just let me know how you guys, what you guys think about the video, about the look. Like, comment, and subscribe. And I guess I'll catch you guys later. Bye.